Yes, sir. You already know it's your boy BH. We back with another one. Let's go ahead and get right into it. You know, we don't like to waste nobody's time. Before we do that, let's give this video a thumbs up so it can reach more people. Today, we're going to be touching bases on SOS Limited. I'm going to just give y'all a quick update, a quick summary. I know some of y'all see oh, SOS falling, falling down to the $6 range. I told y'all to be prepared for it to test the five. The high fives, five seventy, five eighty range to try to scare some weak hand investors out, and it could possibly worst case scenario, it could possibly pull down to five thirty two. Hopefully it don't. Hopefully we don't see that. But you always want to be prepared. I just want to let y'all know, inform y'all. I told y'all this stock is heavily being manipulated because it's a simply play off of Bitcoin. As Bitcoin goes up, it's supposed to go up. Bitcoin go down, it's supposed to go down. Bitcoin was trading at around fifty seven thousand dollars yesterday, and when it's when SOS, uh, when Bitcoin was at 54k, SOS is trading at around ten dollar range. So SOS is way overdue, way oversold, and a lot have to do with a lot of it have to do with that fraudulent news that had came out. People saying that uh, you know scam probably short sellers making fake reports saying that the company is fraudulent, they fraud, they not a real company, and all that good stuff. All that probably goes into play with the manipulation of the stock right now or the stock price but i do feel we will get hammered all through the day maybe and towards the end of the day since it's friday we'll see a nice spike towards the end of the day and into after hours especially if bitcoin is up and holding its highs and come monday we most definitely should probably see a nice push a nice push up maybe we see the double digit numbers and I feel we could see a nice scary scary tree shape because it's going to try to get these weak hands and try to take investor shares right before the weekend try to take your shares so it can open up on monday b so that don't mean go and put everything in on it because uh you think sos want to open up big or i think it's going to open up big that's just a possibility it should because this is simply play i told you plays like this never go all in never put no more than that you ain't willing to lose because it's just off hype speculation in bitcoin and it's very volatile it's like a roller coaster on uh, the plays that we can put a lot of money in i will inform y'all on plays like that i let y'all know plays you can put a lot of money in that's like such as apple tesla neo uh we can go on and on uh you know good companies legit companies uh jnub on um, this ain't the video for that though but i'm just trying to let y'all know that you feel me so that's all i really got for y'all this video i just want to give y'all a quick update on sos and let y'all know don't have weak hands and be shooken out but always use what i told you as your knowledge if you is invested too heavily in it once it reach uh once it reach where we at if it pull back towards 5.99 you could possibly I, I'm not going to sell my shares because even if it go down to the fours, I'm just going to get, I'm down $400 right now, but I'm okay with it because I know, I feel like it's going to go up. And if this thing pulled down to $599, and if you're too heavily in, you could sell half of your shares and buy back in if it pulled down to $535, $20 to give you a lower cost average. So that's all I got for y'all this video. Hope y'all like these quick updates. You already know it's your boy B. Hayes. We out, y'all. Sorry I got on the tank top. Y'all already know I'm going to keep y'all keep i'm gonna stay fresh out here but sometimes early in the morning i might just go on the tank top on so we out y'all god bless